This is Peter Bellano from the Building Your Band podcast. Today I'd like to walk you through the Intuitive Keys Quick Start tutorial. So after you've downloaded Main Stage and you've downloaded Intuitive Keys, you're going to want to look for this Quick Start concert here. Now you can drag this folder or this file right to your desktop or you can drag this whole folder to your Main Stage folder which is in your Music folder. But wherever it's convenient, you can just double click on this Quick Start concert. Now, this contains all the samples necessary to run Intuitive Keys. It's all stock main stage, but even if you haven't downloaded all the content, it's wrapped into this file. So that's why this one's a little bit bigger here. All right. Now, Intuitive Keys is designed to accept all MIDI input, so we should be up and running immediately. So let's check it out. All right. Looks like it's, there's our notes, our sustain. Oh, my sustain pedal is... Re oh, yep. Yeah, my sustain's working. All right. Good. And... We're gonna want to check out our mod wheel. Cool, that's working. A little aftertouch. Check out our other sounds. Add in a piano. Cool, looks like everything's working here. So now, if we're not hearing sound, we may need to pop into our preferences folder. Command comma gets you in there. You know, we want to make sure we're at 440 hertz here. Auto save is set to never. We want to make sure our audio settings, our uh, audio output is set to maybe our Scarlett 2i4. Audio input should be set to none to save some resources. Sample rate should be set at 44.1. You can jump in here and look at the advanced settings, and this is where we would set our buffer. So if you set it too small, uh, your computer's not going to be able to keep up. You set it too big you're going to have latency problems. So we want to set it as low as we can and still have a stable system. So you can play with that a little bit. Set your driver latency probably to more safety and CPU usage to your max number of cores. And that should really do it. All right, thanks for checking out this video and I'll talk to you soon.